How do you get bigger stops in your calf horse? That's a question that everyone's asking. And someone could give the answer, well, they ought to pay him a million dollars. So I'll just be waiting for you guys. <laughs> I'm just joking. Hey, I do want to show you a tip, though, that does increase those big stops, those big sliding stops. And we can always take a look at the people who train their horses to get the big stops and start mimicking or start putting into practice the things that they do so well. One of the things that I look at in reining horses, whenever they're having those big stops, is one thing that they do. You guys have all seen it. What do they do? They increase their momentum and they're pushing their horse with the momentum into the stop. They're not running and then slowing down and then stopping. They're going faster into it. So one of the awesome feels that you can get with a, a calf horse is not, I mean, we've heard this term rate. The horse has got to run in there and they got to rate, but What's even cooler is whenever you can get a horse that knows how to rate, but then whenever he finds his spot, he knows how to increase without going past the calf, increase and push momentum into his body and then stop. And so I'm going to show you a four-year-old that I've trained to do this, that he's, he's a really cowboy horse, but I've trained him to increase or push into his stop so that whenever he goes ahead and finishes, it's smooth. He's elevating the front end. He's pedaling. And it's a big slide stop with great timing. So I encourage you, watch these videos, check out the timing, and try to put more, mo more momentum into your horse as he's in the rate at the final end of whenever you're going to rope it. And it's going to give you some awesome results. So I hope you like it. <laughs>